guys, check out my new pinny. I can't even with myself. Anyway, back to the cooking. <laughs> so I have a new recipe book. No, I'm not bringing out my own silly. I have quite the crush on Joe Wicks, Lean and 15. Don't tell Danny because he bought me the book. Today I'm gonna be cooking Joe's My Oaty Chicken. But I'm actually gonna say it's mine now. So, sorry Joe. So the first thing we need to get it going in here is the chick chick. It's so gross when it's raw. But it tastes good when it's cooked. So let's get it cooking. Place some cling film over your chopping board because nobody wants a disease. And that's apparently what happens with chicken. Oh God. Ugh. Oh crumbs, I didn't tell you what you're gonna need. 50 grams of rolled oats, two tablespoons of flour, where's the teaspoons? Joe, where are you at, buddy? I should do a video as the naked chef. Anyway, I got distracted. So you need 50 grams of ground almonds. You can buy them at any store. Two chicken breasts that I'm about to pulverize on here and absolutely bash them. Some coconut oil or spray, cling film, an egg, and some smoked paprika. Moving on. These are great for freezing, so me and the kids eat them after school. I've got so many kids. Now grab the cling film. No, no, cut. Got yeah. It's all clinging together. Put it over your chicken and we're gonna bash it. Oh. You need to bash them until they're half their original thickness. I don't think I'm murdering someone in here. Now be sure to wash your hands in case you've got any of the germies on there. We are now gonna crack our egg into the bowl. Ooh, ooh, oh, whisk it up. Now that we've really abused our chicken and whisked up some gorgeous eggs, we're gonna prepare our coating. 50 grams or a third cup of the almonds, excuse me, and the same amount of the oats, and then three teaspoons of smoked paprika. Oh God, that's fine. Give it a good mix. So shortly we're going to start our choo-choo train. But firstly, we must preheat a pan to get some coconut oil sizzle sizzling. I am so annoying, but I'm just gonna go with it. Take the chicken onto the board and you need to lightly dust the chicken with some flour. And then you need to do this so there's not any excess into the egg. Right into the mix. I feel like Joe would be so impressed with me. Everybody should tweet Joe and tell him that it should be in his book and this is Jenny's OT recipe. Duh. Pop him in. I love that sizzling noise, makes you feel like a chef. Now we just wait patiently with a smile. Shut up, tap! Now let's wait for our OT chicken so I can eat like a horse. No, my housewife wouldn't say that. Let's wait for our OT chicken so I can feed the rest of the family and nibble on a pea. Huh, guys, I'm actually really impressed with myself. I didn't burn anything, it looks really cute, and it's extremely healthy. Oh God, I'm such a great housewife. I love you, make your OT chicken. You can check out what I paired it with in the last housewife video. It's a bean and avocado salad. Yeah, and I'm gonna go and stuff my entire face. Again, housewife wouldn't say that. I let myself down every time. Beanies are out now and you can buy them in the links below or you can click here. Have you clicked yet? You should click. Oh my God, I'm gonna dribble. Kiss, kiss! Rotten egg. Oh all no, that might be sick. <laughs> oh my God, okay, I got your skunk. <laughs> They're not allowed to spell it out. <clears throat> Get back! Hopefully you get a good one this time, Dad. Oh, there's another oh. one. 